CA baby, we are here, we are in Ponsonby, we've heard all about this busy oven and everybody that's been to St Paul's has told us, get the St Paul's special, I don't even know what the hell that is, but I'm about to find it out and it's all about creativity, here, okay, you got your, your bun, you got all this stuff, creativity is innovation, yeah, so I've got one of the most innovative rappers, INF from Swrrrra, he's here to tell us exactly how creative this thing is, Swrrrra. Man, I need to get one of these t-shirts. Right. Like, you need to sort me out. I'm outgrowing it. I'm slowly outgrowing it. It's hey. too small for me. I'm good. So here, bro, they have this thing called, they call it a St. Uh, St. Paul Special. Okay. So I've, I've never had it before, but yeah. I heard it is next level. Okay. So St. Paul, can I get two St. Paul Specials the, with the cream? D apparently Biggie. Yeah, has sworn by this. Okay, sorry. All right. I, I, I didn't want to bring. This is on you, my guy. So I didn't want to bring him in, yeah. and then be like, yeah, and then um, so our bro is just gonna walk us through this. Okay. So yeah, and then um, what is your what is your preferred go-to here? Ah, oh, steak and cheese, man. Steak, steak and, cheese? and cheese, yeah, or a potato top. Um, but yeah, steak and cheese all the, all the way. Yeah, all the way. All right. Yeah. I think we get, we'll get, um, no, 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 I think um, we'll get the mince. I think two, don't take that one, we'll get two mince pies, we'll be told, uh, mince and cheese? Yeah, mince and cheese. Yeah, that's what you, that's apparently, it's the mince and cheese that makes it. Right, makes right, it right, right, right. You now I used mean? to be against mince and cheese, like, Boomer loves mince and cheese. Yeah. Boomer loves mince and cheese. Okay, and yeah. what else would you, like, are we going uh, sweet things, or are you a sweet tooth kind? I am a sweet tooth, but, mm. um, I don't know, I might pass on that today. Okay. Pass on that today, but um, we're gonna do something different, though, eh? I'll go stick and cheese, please. Yeah, and one stick and cheese, and cheese yeah. please. I actually want one of these, one of these gingerbread men. All right, chocolate you know chip. I haven't had a good gingerbread man in ages. We're gonna get to, and two right. gingerbread uh, chocolate men, please. Sick Thank voice. you. Thank you, Bella. You go first, Bella. Oh, bro, we even got the, we got the tray and everything. Whee! All right. Ooh. Okay, so this St. Paul special, grab yep. one of these. I, this is, I, I've never had it before. Though. Yeah, all right. So I know if we mess this up, the comments will be like, you fellas don't even do it properly, bro. Shut up. Hey, Shut up, St. Paul. Okay, oh, she's a foot long. Yeah, hey, yeah, hey, yeah. Hey. She's a good 12 incher. Damn. Oh, shit, it's the cream, all right. So we've got the cream on the inside. So what we've been told, and please, if you get it wrong, shut up. You take the pie, you break it in half, and you put it in and then you eat the whole thing together. So we're doing a whole cream pie. With bread, or a pie sandwich. Pie sandwich with, with, with cream. cream. Yeah. So oh. St. Paul's on this cream pie shit. Since. Right. It's all boys school, so I don't. So I'll follow you, man. So okay, you, bro, you, so what, let's, let's open this bad boy up. Okay, yeah. Take your mince pie out. Right here. Yep. And pie. And we rip it in half. Yep. And then it goes into the into the cream. Shit. So like this? Exactly. Oh shit. Damn bro. This has gotta come out of you. <laughs> Normally with cream pies. They <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I don't, I didn't even, I didn't even explain that. I didn't even explain that. We're, 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 on, the same, right. we're okay, on the same frequency right now, bro. Let's rub it together, eh? It's, All right. it's still a little. It's oh, docket. I'm dripping, I'm dripping. It's, a, it's All right. All right, here we go. Bro. All right, here we go. Can I just say, <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> I don't know, eh? I don't know. Let's ask these fellas. My bro, are you, you go to St. Paul's? Can you come here for a second? Is this a thing? Do you guys do this? No. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. With the pie in the day? Yeah. Why is it a thing? Is it? Boys just like the day. Do you get one of these? No. No. Oh, oh, fair enough. Okay, so we've been informed cream pie joint used to be two bucks. Um, now, obviously, because of inflation, prices have gone up. And, man, to be honest, bro, I get the novelty of it. Yeah. I get that. You know, oh, yeah. And I get it's convenient. You can just 
rock up, just walk wherever you want to. But man, like it's it's messy. It's Look at that. Separately, I bet they'll taste amazing. Like good. If I'm a kid that's going to school and yeah. I gotta get from here to cross the road as quick as possible mm. and I want a pie mm. and I want a donut mm. and I just, and I want a pie sandwich. Yeah. Put it all in together. It's quite innovative. Yeah. Bro, this is how you become a fucking unit. Yeah. This is how you this just is how you become the all black bro. This is how you all black prop. Starting to get it now. I think like 183 is like the number 183. Yeah, 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 yeah. And you you hit them up. It's almost like a secret menu. Yeah, 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 yeah. You hit them up like, yo, can I get the 183? That's cool. That's what I like about it. I like, I like it all too. of that like, um, you know, low key kind of secretive stuff like, mm. you know, secret passageway or like secret door. All of that stuff. This is like a. You don't get secret doors in South Auckland or Onihonga. You just uh, get, nah, yeah. You just get Penny Lanes, you which just, you, which well, also yeah. you've told us. I, I said, would you like to go to Penny Lanes? Yeah. You said no. Nah. nah, nah. New owners there. The vibe's different. What and was the yeah. vibes like when you were going to school there at Penny Lanes? Um, I guess it was just like this. I think I think when you attach memories and all like moments. You know, on a journey as you're as you're a kid and growing up, you're like, damn, this was it. This is like my cream stick, like you know. And I think that's why a lot of people hold their bakeries down so much because it's like part of their journey in life Same. as a kid, yeah. going going to school, or like they've had moments and special memories. And I guess that could enhance the flavor at the time. Mm. Yeah, because nostalgia, because nostalgia is something that you know makes things either seems more special yeah yeah special yeah but and, and you know like i get asked all the time where's your favorite and i always say cleanser and cleanser is a great bakery yeah but it's really you're 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 100 right it's the nostalgia of mm. oh man this guy looked after me when i was walking to school and i had no food the elements of it are great mm. it's a good good mince and cheese pie but i'm going to take this out and just yeah, cream is good yeah bread is a bit tough but it's it's respectable mm. so yeah every element is good but it's uh and Voltron. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> it's kind of, it's kind of growing on me a little bit. Maybe I when think, you, yeah. I think when the mince is like soaking up into the bread and it mm. softens the bread. Are you changing, are you saying that you're changing your, your rating right now? I'm going to go from, from six. I'm going to bump it up. I might go 6.5. I'm going to, I'm going to go with a seven. Mm. I'm going to go with a seven of the concoction that it is. But in terms of just the mince, the mince and cheese pie here, I'm a fan. So this could be, this could start some beef and I'm a bit worried bro. Why? For, because Diggy's out here, bro. Oh, Diggy Dupe is like, he's rapping about this in songs. You know, he'll rap about it in his songs. Bro, and it's just my opportunity to hit you up, bro. We need to get some bakery run bars in some, in uh, sweated yeah, songs, yeah, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, I'm waiting. Uh, yeah. You know I'll what I'm saying? You. And it's not just waiting, I'm preparing as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, like, things like, you know, I never fold. Yeah, yeah. Like, simplifies in a sausage roll. That's a bar. Yeah. That's a bar, because I old. almost thought you were at the laundromat for a second there. <laughs> Bro, can oh, I borrow your ear, bro, so I can freestyle yeah. it? <laughs> Just freestyle on my ear, bro. Freestyle on my ear. <laughs> All right, we're going with the gingerbread men. They're the, they're the staple. Yeah. The All chocolate right. gingerbread men. Yeah. Owen, um, Owen's put on the beef a bit. Owen's yeah. about to start an eight-week challenge. Mine's a... Uh... Yeah. Bro, your one's got some titties. Does, bro. What do you, do you go, like if you've got a gingerbread man like this, yeah. are you a guy or are you nah, break it off? Nah, I break it, I'm a, yeah, okay. I like to break it off. What's the first one that you're breaking off? Break Probably leg, uh, legs, yeah. yeah. I got legs. Okay. Average. A lot of crunch, eh? You like a lot a crunch? of crunch? Um, <clears throat> nah, I'm more of a softer, mm, you a bit of both, not like, because this is more crunch than it is soft. So many nice cars out here. Once you look past the nice car, you just look at the rims. Cool car, but why are your rims, um, what do, what do they have, eczema? Look at that. Yo, Curved up. Fucking, those rims there got, um. Straight eczema. Vitiligo. Yeah. It's got that Michael Jackson thing going yeah, on. Yeah, 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 yeah. The Vitiligo. Put some cream on that. Here's the thing, didn't get a lot of ginger. Let's just, do they have more ginger again? They're supposed to be, it's ginger man. It's the ginger bread man. I have no idea they have more actual ginger. No. Yeah, why why do why? they call them gingerbread men? Because it's got ginger in it. You didn't like know. the root. Yeah. Extra spice, man. It's just well it I was. I don't know. The bread was ginger or I don't know. I, oh, I have no idea. I, so I thought you were about to I thought you were about to rip some bars right there, bro. I don't know. Hey, 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 hey. And I'll do it in my best uh, INF. Yo. 
the bread was ginger. I didn't let her linger. Oh, Mal Maninga. <laughs> Taste my finger. <laughs> don't, don't, don't. Smell the finger. Smell the finger. Oh. Papa Wadi. Mm. I got some Smarties, not the M&Ms. Oh, shit. Uh, stop me, bro. Stop me. No disrespect to these guys. You'll never catch me up at 3 a.m. baking. Oh, maybe. But. <laughs> Not like this. I'm gonna give this an average. It's above average. It's not. Uh, I'm gonna give it a six. Mainly, it's very crunchy. Mm. And some people liked it. Mm. I'm not a big fan of that. Also, not a lot of crunch. It's more of a cookie. And uh, yeah, that's, I think with the with the chocolate, it was kind of falling off. Maybe it was because we were. Maybe because it was underneath the mm. thing, it melted a bit. It's a bit sweaty. Yeah. It's been, it's been through the walls as well. Mm. What about yourself, brother? Yeah, I also give it a sick above average. I could never make these myself. I mm. don't know how to make them. If this is your local, don't take this personal. This is just our yeah. experience here. Everyone yeah. everyone has different tongues, different tastes, levels. <clears throat> That's why you should never ever trust food reviews. You gotta go there and experience experience it yourself. Sort it, bro. Yep. Like, <clears throat> I'm sick of waiting for this fucking album, bro. Oh, I'm yeah. sick, bro. When I, I interviewed Spike in 2020, bro. Yeah. And he said it's coming out July. I interviewed you. You, you said, hey, it's, it's here when it's here. Is it like the process of it? Yeah. Is it like always changing all the time? I think so. Like, I mean, first of all, you can't rush greatness. Mm. And, Speak on it. <laughs> and I think when you're an artist like when you're an artist or like you know a creative nothing's ever finished mm. you know nothing's ever finished you always want to do better as what you did obviously. last time obviously look at this obviously it's finished what do you mean? i yeah. finished more than you bro yeah, yeah hey i'm not an artist like you bro hey I'm a, well you are i'm bro. a lyricist you're creative yo because no, no. <laughs> um but yeah it's like you know you always set the bar every time like oh this song needs to be like the last song okay you know, you're just constantly climbing and climbing and climbing. And I think that's kind of a, it's a good and a bad thing, but I think all creatives go through it, whether it's like painting or like building. Is it, yeah. Or, yeah. Is it like a spidey sense feel when you're like, yo, I felt like, oh, that's done. Yeah. And, and you yeah. know, like with Stony Hunger, yeah. like how, how fast was that from start to finish when you got that spidey sense, like, oh shit, I think this is done. I think it was a lot, it was a lot quicker based on now oh. um, you know when everything's so exciting and like brand new and you know this is your first ever album and you've got so much to talk about so much to say and you just want to go ah you know give it to everyone um, whereas this time we've been through a lot more we've grown you know we've, we've yeah. you know experienced a lot more life uh, you know we're a lot older now um, so That's I think right. just putting that into words and uh, into music is is a whole new challenge as well so I think there's just taking us time but again you can't rush it man okay bro so you know we can't go without trying a steak and cheese i've only got one steak and cheese for you bro yeah and i want you to give us your unbiased opinion brother all right that's not bad see what i'm saying that's not bad that's what you want man you want to you want to bite and the cheese is there but the reason why you get a steak and cheese pie is the cheese yeah. Yeah. it should be there so i've had this pie before and i've been waiting to come here <clears throat> the steak and cheese here, easy nine and a half for me. The one thing would take it to a ten is maybe, maybe just the bakery's a little bit buttery, maybe yep. too much. Mm. But that's me being picky. It's a yep. nine point five. I can't, you know, like I got to be picky. But yes, that's, a, that's mine. All right, that's a fire score. <clears throat> Let us know, brother. Yeah, I'm going strong, really strong. Eight point five. Oh, that's a strong, 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 real strong eight point five. That's good, this is a good fucking pie. Anyway, INF bro, love guy. Love. Do we need to do an outro?